Hello, back again. Just a quick video showing you how to fix a problem if you try to edit TV head end uh, TV recordings with Video Redo because it will show up an error when you try to save the files, which I will just show you. So if I start Video Redo and I will open a file, there are hairy bikers. I'll just do some random cuts. In D, cut. There, there. Couple more. And cut. So if I go to save video. It uh, doesn't matter if you save it as a MKV or an MP4, it still show the same problem. So if I go select file and I will rename it as test and then click save or select then save. As you can see, we've got an error come up and it won't save the file. So I'm just gonna click a bolt. And you can see you've got a MPEG stream error, a error writing packet. So I'm just gonna click okay and shut down a video redo. If I do now, I'll show you the fix, which only takes a few seconds to do. So the thing we need to do is uh, use a bit of software called MKV Tool Nix. So I'll just start that up. I'm just going to go into my videos, my videos. That's a test file which didn't complete. So I'm going to open up the original, just drag it into the top. And there's the different parts of the video. The thing that is causing the problem is the DVB subs as far as I can tell. So all you really need to save, when you untick them, uh, untick the boxes, it will strip out them parts of the video and the audio. So all I really want is the first two. First one's the video, second one's the audio. So that's all done. And then ju I'm just gonna click start multiplexing. It will automatically rename it. It's just put a, a one in brackets for me. So I know which file it is. Just click start multiplexing. Only takes a few seconds to do. I'm doing this in uh, real time. And that's all done. I can now close that down. So now we've got our second file. So let me open up video redo again. And just drop in the file. I'll just do some uh, random cuts again. In there, cut. There, and there, there, and there. One more, there, and cut. Now I'm gonna save video. You can save it as a MKV or MP4, entirely up to you. So I'll go select file where I want to save it. I'm going to call it test two. Test two. Then click save. Or cl click select, then save. Doesn't take too long to do. And uh, that's the file finished. And as you can see, it's completed. Plus there uh, aren't any errors. So I'll just close that or okay it. Close video redo. And there's our file. So uh, as always, uh, I hope this video has helped. And uh, goodbye.